Hello again everyone. I am filming today on a very special sunny day. <laughs> it's actually very rainy outside and um, I was gonna try to save this for a sunny day for some better natural light but unfortunately that's not gonna happen for a couple days and this video has been requested. It's going to be a what's in my bag and this again is the Merlot Mini Crossbody from Portland Leather Goods. I did the unboxing for it. So I am gonna show you guys what is inside my bag, what fits, um, and I'm also gonna try to see if I can edit in some uh, pictures of me modeling it for you for size comparison. Um, and I will also be doing another video on my uh, Honey Classic Tote the small size. I figured that this would be a little bit too long if I included that one as well. So here we go. Um, to start out, this is the purse charm that I said that I would be getting and I absolutely adore it. Um, it has some burgundy or more low uh, bits of suede along with the leather and then a I can't remember, it says some kind of a geode. Um, beautiful. And that is my purse charm. So I just recently got that. It's from Old State Goods. I leather worker in color, or Denver, Colorado made this for me. So absolutely beautiful. Now let's get into the actual bag. Again, this is the Merlot Mini Crossbody. Still beautiful as ever. And let's see, we'll start with the front pocket here. So what I have is this Italy pouch. I use it for um, my cards and some spare change, which you could probably see in here. And I have cards in here. I have my driver's license in here. Um, I actually got this leather pouch in Italy. Got it in Florence, which is why there's the Flor de Lis here. Um, and let's continue. Let's see here. Ah, uh, one of my favorite lip glosses. NYX Butter Gloss. This is the Angel Food Cake, which is my favorite. It's like a kind of pinky mauve color. And a, oh yes, chapstick, glow sticks, yes. Um, everybody needs some chopstick of some kind, so standard. And my favorite recently, lip balm. Let's see if I can find. It's called Galactic. I got this in an Ipsy Gleam bag plus. Um, it's a Jello gloss balm, and this stuff is great. It slides on awesome, and love it to put it on with one hand. Eventually I'll probably get a tripod, but not yet. Okay, so that's it for the front pocket here. This bag has two handles and it closes via um, a like a button clasp here. So open it up, this is the clasp. And here is all what's inside. So this is actually a bad for work. Let's not show that. Mona, my cat, sorry. She likes to be in videos and mostly in my stuff. So, um, also I have this in my bag. This has a lot of things in it, miscellaneous things. I will show you in this. I actually forgot to show you what was in this little pouch. So I'm gonna try to do that. And please don't mind the buzzing dog if you can hear her. Um, so, I actually got this pouch from Ipsy. I like this one particularly because it's an envelope style. She had a couple things I have in there. So this is just a, it's almost like a deodorant stick, but it is uh, a sunscreen stick. I need it because I burn very easily um, and actually take medication that makes me more susceptible to skin cancer. So I have to take this I actually got in an Ipsy Glam Bag Plus 2, and I have used it a little bit, um, and I love it. It's awesome. So, just holds various pills. I got this from the Tower of Pisa, like, 
plaza there, so pretty cool. Hand sanitizer, wow, I forgot the word for it. Got this a little while ago, I've used quite a bit because, you know, COVID-19 and all that, so pretty cute, smells good. A uh, girly thing, another um, liquid lip. This one's really pink. I like it a lot. I got it in an Ipsy bag as well. So if you don't use Ipsy, I would highly suggest it. It's pretty awesome. I get all my makeup basically from them because I don't know much about makeup. This is a Il Maquillage uh, Black eyeliner just in case let's see what else here i have a kate spade wallet you see she is back she will not stop <laughs> until she's just up here with me um so kate spade wallet it does not match the purse i had this in another purse um probably end up changing it out i don't know that i can show you very much in here because it's got some cards and whatnot but it has an outer zipper and it's just got like cards inside she's knocking things down because of course okay so next up we've got a uh, like planner i never use this thing i try my hardest it also has my checkbook in here so i'm not going to open this up um something i got from target blue sky brand um figured i might use it and write things down but i mostly just use my phone so and we have some glasses that I recently found in another purse. Juicy Couture glasses. Pretty nice. And these things. These are also sunglasses that I got from Amazon and I really like these. They're very extra. Don't know that I'd wear them every day but here they are. Very cool. Oh, you can see me. I'm trying to get my random things. Okay, and hairbrush, which is pretty cool. I also bought this from Amazon. This pops out. Won't pop it out, it also has a mirror. And I have a pen, because everybody needs a pen. I really love this pen, because I don't remember what the heck it is. It's a pilot pen. Um, I think it's like, the, yeah, there it is, Dr. Grip. Love that pen. And this is a Kindle case. My Kindle's actually going to be coming in today. I ordered a paper white because I'm running out of bookshelf space. Um, so hopefully this will help me out. I just wanted to see if it fit in the bag. It does, so I'm pretty stoked about that. And that is all, peoples. Um, that's it. So before my cat continues to knock things down, I am going to put stuff back in here and again I will be posting another video to show you how the small honey classic tote has held up um, pretty well and just to remind everyone like this is all the stuff that was in this Merlot mini it's it's a mini bag but it is holds a lot and I honestly think I could hold a lot more in here um, so there you have it thanks and have a great day